Welcome back to the show. Every year, thousands of Australians are left with brain damage and physical disability after suffering a stroke or being hurt in an accident. But many of those affected are now achieving goals and having experiences they never mm. thought possible. Yeah, it is all thanks to virtual reality. And I went to check out one rehab centre north of Sydney that is leading the way. Take a look. Five years ago, the only thing Rowan could cling to was a hospital bed and hope for a miracle. But today, he's swimming with whales. After shattering his body, falling 10 metres onto concrete, and a stroke leaving him with brain damage, Rowan's family were told to prepare for the worst. For the first few days, they said that he wouldn't survive. Then they said he would be a vegetable and then they said he would only ever live in a nursing home. Now, thanks to Australia's first virtual reality gym, his rehabilitation has never been better. This is Australia's first VR locomotion system. What it does is combines the amazing capabilities of VR with physical locomotion. So you're actually physically interacting with your brain and your body in these amazing environments. And this is what Rowan can see through those goggles simulating the sensation of being underwater, working his brain and his body. So people with spinal cord injuries, people with brain injuries, stroke in particular, patients who've traditionally been resistant to conventional rehab do very, very well in these systems. It's like being a kid again. It just puts you into, wow, this is amazing and I want to engage. Do you feel like you're floating? Yeah, very much so, yeah. That must be quite nice, among it's, the fish in the It's quite whales. interesting. Yeah, you've got to continually remind yourself that, yeah, oh no, I am just in a game. <laughs> Someone who needs no reminding that this isn't just fun and games is Angus. He went out for a bike ride one day and was hit by a car. The next time he came home, he was in a wheelchair. Essentially, the nipple line down, you're supposed to ignore from there down. What difference have you seen over the past four years from the first day that you started your treatment to now? We've gone from absolutely moving nothing to me being able to be on all fours and move my core and have control um, in a crawling position to even recently I can move my foot. Uh, I've moved my foot without electronic stim. Um, that's that's not something that was ever supposed to happen. And if he's not playing with bows and arrows, Angus can even climb Mount Everest. It's just a matter of changing the projection in the goggles, but the physical benefits are the same. So now, it's my turn. Oh, this is faster so weird. And faster now, pull the right trigger. <laughs> it genuinely gives you the sensation of you're falling. <laughs> Do you think this is the future of rehabilitation? In terms of complex stimulation, absolutely. And where it's a real mind-body integration, absolutely. And what's what we're trying to do is pioneer the fact that not only can you enjoy your, your rehabilitation, but there's data to prove it. As for Angus and Rowan, each other's success is the only proof they need. And as you can see by the results, I mean, progress is being made. What have you got to lose? The work we do here, uh, is, is paramount to me moving forward, taking the next step. <laughs> Maybe quite literally. Absolutely. Isn't that wonderful? I absolutely love Angus's attitude. This particular rehab centre, it's called Smart Body, Smart Bar Minds. It's just north of Sydney. It's near Newcastle. And in simple terms, it's pretty much about unlocking those parts of the brain mm. that aren't necessarily pushed to their limits in traditional rehabilitation. Mm. Yeah. So this is just another way of giving people new hope. And as you can see there from both Rowan and Angus, who knows what's possible? That's something that goes back to the impulses, doesn't and, it? And it gives you goosebumps mm. because mm. it's giving hope, isn't it? Totally. Yeah. Also relief, wonderful. psychologically. Mm. 100%. To, to be able to feel like you're capable of doing those things and that you are actually doing those things. Exactly. Great story, Lara. Thank really you. Great story. Fascinating. Uh,